committee. <laughs> we'll have a waking up committee. It'll be different people's turns. Yeah, exactly. Other, exactly. It's not fair to have one person do that. That's right. Because I was the one that did that as well. I'm not going to do that. Yeah, because I was the TA. You're this time right. I'm not getting paid to torture people. Whenever I come in, I want to do this set up in the early morning. I hate it. That's why I'm here. They have really good coffee over there, so that should at least be something to look forward to. <laughs> um, so then Friday, I will organize with the host hostel, so we'll all sort of go to the hostel, drop our stuff off, um, and then around 9.45, that's when we should be sort of heading over to our first stop. Um, we'll jump on the um, subway, um, and we will be meeting with Rob um, oh, and we're going to look at the water cross mirror. So we'll look at the floating um, uh, housing that's there, and then look at sort of water resilience building um, in Amsterdam, um, and then doing the Iber and the uh, Amsterdam rainproof facilitated, which I've never heard of. And then 5 o'clock is, is sort of the end. Um, and we thought because Thursday night we sort of have our big event together and our big send off, so we figured Friday night we'll let you guys have your personal send off. <laughs> uh, there are a couple of real logistical issues that we have to do. Mm -hmm. Some of them uh, have to do with the, uh, I guess it's a release form. Yep, uh, but everybody should, A has the release form. And we should have signed it. And if you haven't signed it yet, sign one other thing to do before Thursday. There's a copy of the release form in the back there. So fill it out, drop it in Jamie's mailbox, um, scan it probably for your own records. Everybody needs to have that money. Uh, everybody should have brought money today in the amount of three hundred and seventy seven dollars. Checks are fine. Um, I will keep track of everything. And I will change it into Euro on Friday. The reason for that, by the way, is that a lot of these places, because our credit cards are not foolproof. The Europeans have a much better system than we do. They don't accept our credit cards. So uh, both, uh, they do, but it's it's a, a, your cards have an extra chip in Yeah, an extra chip in So uh, one of the things is, you, you can buy things. You can buy things and you'll get money out of the machines. But when we had to pay for the, uh, I to, uh, paid the third and uh, for the hostel in one place, he would pay for another one. We had to pay for the buses. Uh, yeah. It's just, and when you're paying like in thousands of dollars, your credit card worries right. about yeah. you and they call you. So, so some of those are going to be paid. So, and also, like, we're going to keep track of all the funding. I'm going to keep track of everything. If by any chance there's like a refund at the end, you get $5 gold, we'll happily give you money. So, this is sort of like a deposit, and then we'll track it. It's awesome. So it's 377. I think that's whatever amount I emailed, yeah, which I believe was 377. Oh, we're not $27. Uh, yeah, it is it. My name. Who is it? Okay. My first, uh, oh, oh, for that, for the for release? The, for the check. Oh, for the check, my name. G I T A. Mm -hmm. And the last name is Nandan, N A N D A N. And just put that on the bottom of the screen. Right. Yeah. That includes the hostel? Yeah, that, that's basically, so in that email, I said it's for your hostel. It's for the bicycle, it's for the tours, the museum entrances. Um, the things it's not for is for your train ticket when you get there, because I won't be there with you to do that. Um, and it's not for food, except at RDM, I think RDM, I don't know how we'll handle that. We'll figure it out. Some of the group things will come from this. Right. And uh, the, the hostel includes breakfast. Right, it includes your breakfast. It does not include the 15 euros that you have. For your ferry for your ferry ride. So those are sort of the basic logistics. Do you guys have any questions? Yeah? I have a question about just technology. 
Um, we talked a little bit about maybe bringing laptops. Yeah. We're going to do research over there, um, but also um, it's also nobody really, have, really likes to travel and haul around a laptop with them. Are you guys? Is it absolutely required that we try to bring our laptop with us? Okay. I'm going to say that if we get a quorum, mm -hmm. just be like figure out if we can share. <laughs> Yeah, that, that's totally up to you. I'm going to say, like, traveling in Holland is actually fairly safe. Okay. Um, you know, it's heavy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's heavy. Yeah, it's heavy. I totally agree. Okay. It's a total pain. If you have an iPad, you might choose to bring an iPad instead. You know, bring a keyboard. Yeah, you may, like, be in groups of four and decide, you know, you're going to share this laptop and just slap it around. So, you want. so the facilities at RDM, when we go and work with other students, are, do you know if they have, like, a computer lab that we might be able to use? Or I'm not? sure they do. They have computers. Yeah. They don't have a computer lab. I think everybody has a desktop computer lab. Yeah. Okay. And I'll bring, I'm going to bring my laptop so anybody can use that also. Because I'm actually going to be fairly technology heavy. Because I'm not going to be in any of this way. I have to worry about it. So I think that, so I'll, I'll have to share mine. I'll bring mine 13 inch. Yeah. yeah. Uh, That's a good What I suggest you bring is a flash drive. Oh, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, and actually, most of these hostels have computers in them that oh. you can use. I mean, they're not going to have like Photoshop, but, you know, right. like, just not, take notes but just like, like, like a lot of places like internet have internet. Yeah, exactly. Like, and, 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 you know, bring a, bring a, a law, a book. That yeah, you really I mean, use. I highly encourage you guys to bring sketchbooks, you know, you and you actually just sketch, you know, and take notes and draw. Uh, oh. <laughs> and bring pencils, you know, they, they work too. <laughs> Great technology. Exactly. Because our laptops can't really run without storage. It can be bothering you. Yeah, see, don't bring your laptop. Your laptop's terrible. Do we need to bring it out? Yes. 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 You should bring an adapter. An adapter for Europe? They ha at Best Buy, they have like the universal one that's like $14.99. Yep. There's a, on Smith Street, there's that little travel store. You can buy a little universal one that is like, you know, so really nice and they're super expensive, relatively speaking. Otherwise, you can just buy the one that's for your, sure. which is a, a plug. And most of your computer usually has a built in. Yeah. If, if it's heavy, don't take it. If it's, if it's really heavy, I wouldn't. I wouldn't it's on there. Not, there are going to be enough computers around. It's a very technologically savvy country. In fact, it may be a little bit over us. Do you have any copy of the itinerary? Yeah, they're around. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, so a couple of things. Your cell phones, if you want to change your plans, I told you about that before. The second thing was just changing money ahead of time so that way you don't have to worry about it there. Um, I was going to. Yeah. yeah. Oh, you mean for your ATM card? Yeah. Yeah. Otherwise, yeah. immediately it's fraudulent. Right. Right. Um, and then get an adapter if you need to plug things in. Um, it's, I don't know, it was really warm the other day. I haven't looked at it. It looked like a little bit chilly. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. So I would bring, and I would bring a raincoat um, just in case. I hope it doesn't rain, but uh, it's known to just sort of like randomly sprinkle in the middle of the day. So. The best thing to do is drink layers. Yeah, like it's in the 60s, better than here, but, <laughs> but Saturday it's actually you supposed to be one a little bit, bit. Uh, Sunday 54 and sunny, but that's not hot, you know, so. And sorry, just, is there a reason why you think that we should I just don't, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be running. Like, I'm gonna run from the train, I'm gonna run, you know, I'm gonna run to the hotel, I'm gonna take a shower, I'm gonna run to meet you. I'm gonna, like, I'm just not gonna, there's just not gonna be a moment where I'm gonna be like, oh, that's kind of, you know. Because even like in the airport, there's an ATM. Yeah. 
There's also a money changer in the airport too, but I find that the airport very is very, very expensive. It's better than it's like 10 per month. Yeah, I try to so avoid those. So I take a little bit of money. You may be able to pay for the ticket, by the way, by that credit card. Yeah. And that's better than exchange rate. Yeah. What about like laundry? Like, would it be a good idea to bring less and then do laundry more, or just like bring more? I would like to let you know that that's what I'm planning on doing. Yeah, me too. Yeah. You want to read the hostel will have a service? It does, yeah. I, 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 Are you Usually there's a service <laughs> they offer you that's like, whatever, a dollar a pound or something yeah. like that. You okay. know, and you can right. just read through that. Um, most hotels do that also. The hostel also said that um, the, they do offer towels, but you have to pay a, one euro for the towel. Okay. Okay. But for your whole state, a lot of different towels every day. Right. Okay, so that's sort of it with our organization. Any more questions? Otherwise, we should we should let the. This was to be One was: Is there a dress code for any portion of our international stay? I'm gonna say I'm gonna say dress smartly. So number one, you should wear shoes that aren't going to be painful. So like no super high heels. Y'all like to dress up, but <laughs> I save those for the cocktail party. Um, you know, we're going to be hiking and walking and we're just like on our feet a lot. So mm -hmm. be super comfortable and smart about that. Wear lots of layers, you know, no shorts. You're going to be going from you're, working sessions. You're, yeah, you're sort of so like, just I would say 